Hi everybody, this is Sam with Python Basics, <clears throat> and we need to talk about something uh, about tkinter. And it can seem a little weird, but we're becoming more advanced. So let's just jump into it. So if you're new here, thanks for joining us. This is what we do. We learn something, we build upon it, we dig, we dig into it, we we go we go from there. So all right, tkinter is for is a GUI. Uh, graphical user interface. So um, let's just import this because bear with me this can get weird but we're gonna go slow until we get it. So, okay let's look at tkinter. Here are anybody see TTK here? No. So let's do tkinter and we're going to learn about a package that's sitting inside of it and we're going to import it. And like I said, we're getting more advanced and you're going to see some redundancies, but they're different. We're going to learn about the TTK module. So all right, let's go all the way to the top. Okay. And it sits right here. So you have to import it. So now let's look. I think it's right around here with label. And let's keep our eyes right here. Does anybody see TTK? No. <clears throat> so let's come down here. So since it's right since it's a package right inside, you import it just like this. Import cuz we didn't see it, so if we do dir on tkinter.ttk, you don't see it. So you have to import it. tkinter.ttk as ttk. Follow me? Okay. So now watch this. Boom. Here it is. So, all right. Remember. I think it's right here, label. All right. So now let's run dir on ttk. Oop, oh, goes back to button. I'm sorry. I misremembered. So okay, there's a little bit of redundancy, but they're not the same. I'll show you later that ttk is smoother and they've rounded off. It's it's more elegant. So Bear with me on this, I'll show you this later, but I wanted to show you because we're going to be using the TTK uh, module because it's it's just prettier. So as you can see, button it drops out it drops out a lot of a lot of these, but it has the necessities. Alright, and we're going to change and touch up this just a little bit. So import tkinter dot ttk as ttk so there we go that and then now we still have our window just like this but going forward because I didn't want to start this with tkinter and have have tk objects and then change this on you we're doing this one at a time showing you best practices as this is the preferred uh, module because it's the it's the higher end module so and we'll go from there and I'll show you the difference between them of how smooth the edges are and just how um, nicer looking it is so real quick video today about uh, the TTK module and tkinter um, and you guys are doing awesome asking some awesome questions um, really d I appreciate all the shares that you guys are doing I uh, got a got a report at the beginning of the month and um, more shares last month than I think I've ever had so thank you to you guys uh, I, this is still kind of amazing that people are still watching the videos so um, I love it I love doing this I love sharing it so thank you guys very much so please don't hesitate to leave any comments questions or any video requests below and I'll knock them out so as always guys Thanks for watching. Stay tuned, and we'll see you next time. Bye, guys.